All right, ladies and gentlemen, now who wants some more action tonight? Do you want some more action? All right, coming up next, we've got a featured attraction. First out, fighting out on the red corner, representing Uzbekistan, Emily Boyko Bilov. Yeah, I hit the ground and I go off. Yeah, hit the ground and I go off. Yeah, yeah, run it, run it. Oh, I really feel it's my time, think it's my year. Yeah, yeah, I really feel it's my time, think it's my year. Yeah, yeah, I really feel it's my time, think it's my year. Yeah, yeah, I really feel it's my time, think it's my hand ready. Used to hold myself back, my selfish thing damn bad. I gotta keep on chugging, ran through everything in front of me. Might smoke bed in heaven, gotta hold no surrender, got a dollar fifth up. I'm trying to get an NFT to get them when they're hand in crypto. Learn how to fix that. I don't really hold out of books, but I'ma learn how to fix that. Some opportunities are never come unless you're paying attention. So no, I can't miss that. Moving. MVP, I got the record. I might have to pro some. Big jumper worthy. They gon' have to retire my jersey early. Whole crew coming. Had to work something because I had nothing in my pocket. Yeah, I did all that. Big plans. Partners trying to make profits. Yeah, I did all that. Work sweating, tears breaking, even no ends. Yeah, I did all that. Had to make it happen. Put now was our featured attraction of the fight today is Rally as he makes his entrance into the ring. And I can't wait for this fight. This is going to be a showstopper for sure. First of its kind. Action for the night. First off, fighting out of the right corner to my left, representing Uzbekistan, Air Rally Boyko Bilov. And his opponent fighting out of the blue corner across the ring, representing Tajikistan, Mehdi Garcia Abdu Rose. And when he actually begins to refer in charge, Don Tiran. Tale of the tape, 1.4 million followers for Abdurazak, while Irali has 
All right, fight fans, are you guys ready for this? Are you guys ready for this? This is the one we've All been right. waiting for, guys. Come on, everybody, make Ladies some noise now. Let's go. we've been waiting for. Yeah. The star attraction. A rally versus Abdul Razak. They were making a lot of strides and a lot of commentary back and forth during the press conferences and even the weigh-ins. And it's sure to be fireworks now as it's one of, as it is our co-main event before we hit the main event. In the red corner, our white-shorted fellow is a rally. And in the blue corner, Abdul Razak in the black and gold shorts. Our refs ready to get us Boxes, started. obey my instruction all the time. I don't want to see and repeat punches. Kid me, all below the belt. Touch gloves, good luck. Ladies and gentlemen, this battle's three rounds of 1.5 minutes each. You know, Abdul Razak looks uh, worried. I thought Irali is the one that should be worried. It's Abdul he's, he's looking very confident. He just gave me a wink. He just looks very confident, does a rally. He looks like he's about, he's ready to go, my man. There we go. History in the making. The rally's coming, swinging hard. The rally's got these punches and bunches. Abdul Ruzak throws a couple in and then pushes back. You know, the uh, rally's moving forward. Abdul Razak is, is being warned. I, I feel that Abdul Razak almost quit. He does look worried. You can see that on his yeah. face. But I think, you know, as he as he continues into this ring, he'll find his place. It's just, will it be enough? Uppercuts from Abdul Razak. Wow, taunting, taunting from the rally. <laughs> rally taunts him. Tells him to come in. Come into the pocket, he says. Go in the pocket, I'll show you something. Abdul Razak is telling him, you come to me. Nice, nice, nice jab there from Abdul Razak. Arali just punches and punches again. That's kind of the game plan, it seems, isn't it? Taunts him some more, there's Arali. A lot of great punches coming out of Arali. A lot of great punches. Abdurazal has finally got one shot in, and now he gave him some confidence moving. Nice, there, 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 was a, there was a couple of shots there that landed from Abdurazal. Yeah, yeah, but you know, Arali just gassed out. Look, he's breathing hard. He keeps screaming at Abdul Rizza. Interesting first round, but I definitely have to give it to Arali. He seems like the more confident fighter in there. Uh, not the most technically sound, but punches and bunches win the fight, my friends. Yeah, it's a lot of significant strikes here. Yeah, uh, you know, I think that some uh, some uh, strikes came in towards the end of the fight from Abdul Razak. And here we see in the replay. Abdul Razak's beginning to warm up here. You see that right kind of connected? Well, he needs to calm down, Ali. He really, really yeah, I think, I think that the stars, the, 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 the ambience, the, the crowd, and just this anxiety that I was talking about earlier is just getting to him. I think once he gets past the first round, he'll calm down. <laughs> and look at Irali, I love like, that. I love that. Yeah, like the pinage that he has. I got it. You got to love that. He's definitely the more confident fighter in this fight. Let's see what the coaches have told their fighters. Here's round two. Abdul Razak in the black shorts and Arali in the white shorts. Arali, same game plan. Coming in, punches and bunches. But you know, he gasses out towards the end, so Ole uh, Abdul Razak needs to kind of wither the storm. Yeah, I agree with you, Rio. You gotta weather that storm and just, you know, find Find moments where you can just implement your game plan. And I feel Abdul Razak is panicking. He should not panic because he's not doing so bad. He should concentrate on straight punches versus, you know, those haymakers that uh, Irali is doing. The difference is the confidence between the two. That's a slip. I don't think that yeah, was a that, knockdown. I don't think that was a knockdown. It's yeah. a slip, yeah. And he, he's, he's telling him, don't trip him. He said, he kicked me to my stomach. He kicked me to the stomach. And he told him, don't kick him to the stomach of our first time, don't kick him to the stomach. Yeah. I, was there a kick? I didn't see the kick. I didn't see it either, but I'd, I'd love to see Abdul Razak just kind of relax a little bit and throw his throw his combinations, because I feel if he does, one of those is going to land and just put a rally back. A rally needs kind of something to just hit him so he can just 
back up a bit. But O'Reilly is a, is a boxing machine. He's going forward. Look, he's actually doing some strikes to the to the body, and Abdurazik now is pushing. You got to wonder how much gas is left in O'Reilly's gas tank right now. I, that's I like got to be tired. Right I like Abdurazik going straight punches versus uh, hooks and stuff. He's going to the body more. I see that. He is. He's feeling a lot more comfortable. That's for sure. You know, in my book, it's one round each. So that was an interesting round in the sense that Abdul Ruzik <laughs> is starting to find his rhythm. He's starting to calm down. Still a little bit anxious. You see that in his face, but there are moments of brilliance. Here we see some nice shots here from Rally. Uh, most of them are blocked, but a couple get get through. But I like the defense here. I like the defense from Abdul Ruzik. It's just he's getting bullied, isn't he? I think he just needs to actually avoid him at the beginning and concentrate on knocking him uh, out or down at least in the middle of the round. Well, well I'll tell you what I, I'd like to see, uh, Rio. I'd like to see him throw more jabs as, as a rally comes in. Because as he comes in, he throws stiff that jab. jab, a stiff jab, it's going to wake him right up. And a rally will, will realize very quickly he can't come in like that. And he ends up having the, 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 the brunt of the hit because he's moving forward and he gets a jab waiting for him. Yeah, that, that, really that's a slip there that we saw. Moving into round three of our star attraction here, the co-main event between Abdul Razak in the black and gold shorts and Arali in the white shorts. And so far, it's really been the story of Arali dominating this fight with his punches. Arali is very confident. He looks like he has more power. He's winding up for his hits, but he gasses out because of those wind up. And look how he's leaving his jab out there, like making sure that uh, uh, Abdul Razak doesn't come close to him. It's really about being comfortable in the ring, isn't it? And you can just see who's more comfortable than, than, than the other. It, a rally just seems to be really in his zone right now, implementing his game plan, and Abdul Razak is trying to find moments, but it's just too much. It's hard to think when you're getting punched in the face. But two warnings from the referee, he should say something more than just a warning at this point, like he's pulling him as he's getting hit to the to the back of the head. But Irali, like, see, that's the third hit to the back of the head, and the reach is actually to the advantage of the, the man in uh, in the white Irali. And he, but he's gazing out. He's gazing out. And where we have 16 seconds. Nice shots there from Irali as he continues to push. Abdurrazik took a couple of punches there to the face. He comes back with a couple punches of his own, but I don't think it's going to be enough. And again, the, the tale of that round is a rally dominating the pace, controlling the, 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 the ring, and just a lot of punches, throwing a lot of punches, which is landing a lot of significant strikes. Oh, I guess this one is four rounds, Ali. Three. Yeah, it's a star attraction, so fourth and final round coming in. On the way. Let's have a look here at the replay. And that's really the story of this fight, isn't it, Rio? Oh, no, there, there is three rounds, not four rounds. I don't know why they say four rounds. No, it's four. No, I think it's three. Now there's disagreement if it's three rounds or four rounds. It, it is, is four rounds. It is four rounds. Got, yeah, it is four rounds. Ref got distracted. I don't blame him. I am getting distracted every single time. All right, ladies and gentlemen, here we go. We're coming up fourth and final round. Fourth final round and our co-main event here between Arali and Abdul Razak. The touch gloves at the center. You know, uh, so far in my in my book, it's actually two <laughs> rounds to run. The rally's dancing. I love it. You love to see it. Ooh, ooh, twice he tagged him. Nice jabs. Actually, this is a good round so far for uh, Abdul Razak. I'd like to see Abdul Razak just relax and just let go a bit. I, I feel like something could come out of it if he just calms down a bit. He, should, he needs some straight punches. He needs some straight punches. 
honestly, on my, in my book so far, Abdurazak is winning this round because he's landing his jabs and there's his crosses straight to the face of uh, Irali. Irali won two or three rounds. Yeah, definitely won three rounds. In my books, Irali's winning this fight. So it's go for broke right now for Abdurazak. He's really got to pull something deep out of his hat and go for broke. Stronger, oh, nice shot there like from Rally. He took a nice hook. There was a nice right hook there that kind of turned on the Rozak. And there it is. That's the end of that fight. <laughs> you gotta love this guy. Excellent show of boxing between these two. I want to say, I want to say professionals, man. That was great. Win, lose, or draw, I mean, we're all winners here. I mean, that was a great fight, great show of sportsmanship between those two. And we're gonna take it into the ring. Let's take it to the ring with Steve on the mic to get the official decision. Is everybody having a good time? Ladies and gentlemen, after four hard four rounds, we declare both of them champions. What a great match, ladies and gentlemen. Give it up for a rally boy, Kabilov, and Abdu Rozik for your social knockout three featured bout of the night. He thinking he did more punches than his opponent, and he think he win the fight. What? Uh, no, I, I'm trying to see it from your point of view. Uh, would you do this again if you got offered a rematch? Yana, agar predlajene bo se revanche kile samadu Yes, we will do revenge. Next time I will knock him out. Thank you. Thank you, Arabi. Thank you. Dubai. I love you, Uzbekistan. Thank you for everyone to come and support us. Okay, Abdurazak, your opponent thought that you actually, he won the fight. What do you think? I heard you say that you're the winner. He just punching in my back of head and he thinking he win. Zero, no. 
I also I need six rounds. They're making three rounds. Why? I want it. I want it six rounds. Why did it three rounds? So if we do a rematch and you end up having your six round, do you think you'll beat him up? He has to pay me because why I'm doing him famous. He has to pay me after I will do. Uh, I don't want to without nothing making him famous. He has to pay me for making him famous because I am bigger than him. I will fight again in revenge and he wants to say something more. You don't know how to talk, to your team is teaching you. You have to learn to how you your own self talk. Uh, he thinking he's punching uh, went strong and he's dizzy now. Okay, your champions, Abdul Razak and Irali. Come on, ladies and gentlemen, once again, let's give it up for Irali Boy Kovalov and Abdul Razak. Well, it seems that he firmly believes that he won the, the fight and he wanted to have six rounds instead of uh, four. Is, uh, yeah, I, I heard that. I, I heard he wanted the six rounds. Uh, Abdul Razak wanted six rounds and he firmly believed that. What, what are your thoughts, Rio? What did you think of that fight? Well, I, I honestly do think that Abdul Razak lost the fight, but there were a couple of shots behind the head. I thought the referee should have deducted some points. It's difficult to call those, you know, at that size as well as like, you know, with, with boxing as well, you're constantly moving around, you're constantly bobbing and weaving, so it does become difficult. But yeah, I also agree with you. I thought Rally did win that fight, unfortunately. Um, you know, Abdul Ruzak fought otherwise. But hey, make for a great rematch, 100%. Yeah, six rounds, another, I think everyone enjoyed this, this fight. Yeah, that was a great star attraction for sure. And, uh, you know, we look forward to seeing them back in the ring. I think they're, they've become uh, a firm testament uh, in the social knockout uh, sphere, if, you, if, you, if I can say it like that. Well, hey, look, it's great entertainment. I like what, what happened. 